You got Kat and JJ. So this morning before the show, I have to admit, <laughs> I got a little off track. My mind wanders every once in a while, and my ADD starts catching up. And I started down this rabbit hole of watching news bloopers, which led into watching inappropriate innuendos that were broadcast on live television. Okay. And so what I did is I recorded a few of them because usually when I come in here and if I watch them in the studio, I laugh hysterically. And then she gives me the look of like, God, you are a five-year-old idiot. <laughs> like it, 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 it looks like Big Daddy when he's sitting with the cereal bowl and the milk is coming down the middle of the chin. <laughs> That's what he looks like. But I can, even if I'm like, if I scooch low enough where nobody can see me, <laughs> I can feel her look through the back of the monitor here. Uh-huh. So here's what I want to do. Sometimes I think these are actually funny and you think they're funny, but you have a good way of masking it. So what we're going to do is we're going to call this spit take. What you must do to see whether or not you actually believe that this is funny or not Mm -hmm. is take a drink of water and hold it in your mouth. Okay. I don't want boogers to come out my nose. And you want water on your equipment? All right. uh, Okay. okay. Uh, I don't know. All All right. right. We'll we'll put plastic down next time. But for this time, go ahead. Take a drink of water. Hold it in your mouth. More. More. Okay. Now, number one. This was broadcast on live television. You're already almost losing. (laughs) Oceanic explorer P.H. Nargelet has made 30 trips 3,600 meters down to the Titanic. But he's never seen a 100-meter gash. <laughs> no! Boogers are going to well, come out of my nose. Okay, 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 so... I need a tissue. Okay. Well, uh, I'm going we got, we got to... I have a cold. Here. Okay, no, This right. is the perfect for this. All right, another drink all of water. Right, okay. You're one for one. Good job. You kept your composure hey, any, there. Any open orifice joke you're going to take. It's a low-hanging fruit. Okay. This one's not an open orifice joke. Terrific return. Right up the middle, deep and hard, and again in the brown patch. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, we got her on that one. We got her on that one. We got her on that one. All right. Tennis bloopers are the best. All right. Here's number Into three. the brown spot, she said? Into the, the, is right down the middle in the brown patch. Okay. Perfect. At Wimbledon. All right. <laughs> Mm-hmm. And this one has to do with nature, mm-hmm. so it's natural. And he'd been wanting to do this for years, and he is, yes, hoovering the beaver. Mm-hmm. 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 Wow, well, you did, you kept your composure on that one. Good job. Listen, years of working with you, I've learned to deter from any beaver joke. You've conditioned me. Well, so this is only your. We've had fault. enough Bemidji State interns through here That's that we true. do get conditioned. A lot of beavers. There's only two left. Okay. So far, you're two for three. Big, dr- big no, big drink, big drink. You're faking it. Back at the dump, Sarah loved the look of Elizabeth's old box and asked if she could tinker with her taps. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> I got her. All right, I got her. I got her. I got her. Oh my God. All right, two for two. <sighs> you got me. This the is box. The, this is the last one. <laughs> All right. All right. Saving the best for last. Big drink. Big drink. Mm-hmm. No, you, you're faking it. Mm. Bigger drink. Bigger drink. Mm. Bigger drink. Mm. I'm not playing it. Bigger drink. I'm a spiritual ecologist, and I believe that through feasting and through food, I connect with the universe. <laughs> a nice big meal. Feasting there. Mm. Wow. You kept your composure through that? Congratulations. I'm on camera. Great. I can't have these wow. boogers shoot out. I had to think of something dark. Wow. Those are all extremely funny, though. I if I was very, watching a compilation, I would probably be laughing. I am very impressed. I thought we would get water everywhere. Well done. What makes me laugh? Do you ever wonder, like, what really the makes me laugh? The stupidest things on the, the planet. The stupidest things. And they come out of nowhere. We run... Audio clips of high-end comedians on this show all the time. He catches goes, mm. uh. but <laughs> somebody could say something like, "Terrific return, right up the middle, deep and hard, and again in the brown patch." <laughs> See? How can you deliver words like that? 
As so a broadcaster and yeah. not know. The KCLD Playhouse is powered up by Bradshaw and Bryant Law Offices. Seeking justice for the I'm injured. I'm sorry, I know you wanted like whatever. You I, did, I really but. expected there to be uh, an engineering situation yeah. here this morning, but uh, well done. You kept your composure. Yeah. All right. Uh, today, we're going to whip out the tarot cards here next, so it's a clean environment. Kat's going to shuffle these up. Nope. It's time for a Fortune Friday. We can only do one round because what we have before 7 a.m., is one of the single best pranks that has ever made the news. So we're going to spend some time on that. But first, a quick round of a Fortune Friday. So Kat's got these tarot cards that we bought at a rummage sale for a quarter a few years ago. We're going to shuffle them up. We're going to tell you what your horoscope looks like and what your future holds. But you got to be one of the first two people through right now at 251-1047 to do this with us next.